Hey guys, Professor Bell, Comic Book University, and The Incredible Hulk, issue number 710. This is Planet Hulk, part two-ish, continued. The second Planet Hulk storyline featuring totally awesome Hulk, you know, uh, Amadeus Joe. So check this out. This is really more like Mad Max than anything else. I mean, it's in a gladiatorial arena, but they're using like cars and, and all sorts of things like that. And it's just, it, it's awesome. I love it. I absolutely love that. But it's not... It's not as much Planet Hulk as it is infested with that. I mean, they even got like the 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 screaming and the the the, the things that they're going to call out, the iconic sayings and things like that. You know, their own version though. You know, like uh, um, they they keep saying he's not just the Hulk; he's the World Breaker. So that you know, the the crowd is shouting, "Break our world! Break our world!" And it's it's actually kind of cool. <laughs> you know, like uh, I'm digging all this stuff. You know, they've got different sayings, like you know. Um, that they would have in the regular Mad Max, uh, the latest one, you know, uh, like, you know, embrace me now as opposed to witness me, you know, like things like that. They've got that. It's great. It's great. I love it. Uh, Amadeus is uh, just like Greg Pak promised. Uh, the, the Hulk Generations story, the Hulk's Generations uh, that that first issue that actually which was a one shot but it's the first issue in the generations anyway guys this actually does have some kind of a bearing on the future Hulk because he's letting the Hulk out of the trunk but at the same time he's he's holding him back enough that he could still control him so he can walk up in his mind and say okay that's it the match is over I need you to get back in the trunk now and the Hulk will get back in the trunk and then you know Amadeus is in control of the the Hulk again you know still staying in the in the Hulk body. But it's, it's his mind. And he's talking to everybody. He's like, all right, guys, you know, pound it. And they're teaching everybody. Like, they're actually using the whole thing. Like, you know, okay, fist bump each other. You know, pound it. <laughs> it's like, that's, I love it. I love all these different little things. This is actually really good. It's endearing. It's heartwarming. It's Amadeus having to do what he's got to do to survive. I know a lot of people don't like, you know, Amadeus is a Hulk. Uh, sorry. I <laughs> don't know what to tell you, bro. But I genuinely enjoy, for what it is, I enjoy this, all right? For what Greg Peck is allowed to do, I'm genuinely enjoying this, you know? Uh, we know the Hulk is coming back. He's actually going to be coming back soon. He was uh, hinted at in one of the uh, Marvel on YouTube uh, videos. I can't remember which one, but he was he was shown that he's coming back and he's coming back soon. So maybe Planet Hulk will have something to do with that. Maybe World War Hulk, which comes at, which potentially comes after this, will have, I don't know. Maybe I think it's actually No Surrender. That's the video that was, so that's what it's going to be. Either way, this is great. I really like this. Um, there's so many things that are familiar, so many things that are different, and then different plays on the familiar. It's good. I don't have any complaints about this, really. Uh, in fact, I'm just going to give this a B plus. This is very enjoyable. Uh, it's enjoyable enough that I'm reading it. <laughs> I'm, I'm not. I, I have no intentions of putting this down whatsoever. This is good stuff. That's what this is. If I did have to make one complaint is that the element of surprise was kind of lost, but I get it because there are enough people complaining about this, I'm sure. Uh, next issue is going to feature Odin's son, the, uh, the, the red scar version of, you know, whatever, this, this, uh, the red king. He's based the warlord. He's saying, okay, uh, go into the portal and go back to Earth. He's like, what, to look for his, uh, his friends? No, to look for his enemies. So they're going to bring Odin's son forth. To actually get into combat with Thor. Um, I don't know why I didn't think that this was actually going to happen. Especially considering the movie and all that stuff right now. And the uh, digital comic that's out right now. Hulk vs. Thor. Uh, Champions of the Universe. Which just ended this week. But next issue is going to feature Odinson getting into it with the Hulk. Um, cool. Cool. It would have been cooler to me. Since I'm already reading this. If it would have been like that surprise factor. But... I get it. I get it. You know, you're trying to draw people to read this comic to see how good it is. So, you know, as opposed to people just figuring, let's just give it a try. Whatever. I get it. I get it. Anyway, guys, Professor Bill, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.